plastics industry. Uh, it seems uh, hard to believe that it was more than 27 years ago that I helped to start the Plastic News, a business newspaper in the United States. You know, plastic is really one of the probably biggest challenges of our time. I'd like to take you on a journey today. We're going to start, let's say, somewhat of a sad place, but I hope that we wind up at a place with a very positive future. The smartphone of the future is just a one millimeter thick. So we look at the one of the nutrition units, we have 220 schools, uh, 270,000 students in food and problems. I feel pretty strongly that this composting biodegradability and value composition is critical when it's very targeted applications. Looking at this is definitely scalable continues to, to innovate in this, making sure more people come into, into their closing and cycling to make this happen, to make this really That's great in terms of mitigating climate change, but we have many other issues. And sometimes when we seek to address one environmental issue, we create another environmental issue. It was created so fast that my collection soon began to fill up the desk drawers and even pile up on the tables. It is a beauty pageant we focus on environmental friendly career and the one to protect our mother earth. Uh, my business has offices in different parts of the world, including here locally in China, in Guangzhou, in Austria, and also in the UK. This issue is much worse because that recycler has to get streams from many MERS in order to have even a even a small economy scale. Issues in plastic waste management that appeared 20 years ago, they are still prominent today. Very disappointing. There are actually a lot of processes uh, in, the, in the overall recycling. Traditionally, the old type might waste model. What I'm going to talk about today is how to potentially recover a large demographic of plastic that's in the next plastic waste stream right now, we talked a lot about that. In the center of the compilation, the field will recycle and be cloudy, and the physical performance is also not good. And really then just designing the process to be amenable towards different types of waste, right? Perhaps what excites me the most is on the technology side of things. We had some brands that are on the front line, Dell, uh, Watson's and Interface, all doing pretty big changes, they committed to that.